here. Basically, I guess I'll start with performance because I haven't done too much. Just did the pulley and the tune, which makes about 720 to the wheels. Okay. So about 800 horsepower. Um, I have a CNC, chrome and carbon. From, he's on Instagram, it's chrome and carbon, front splitter. Okay. Uh, and rear diffuser, they're both uh, carbon fiber. One, one question though, sure. um, did you do any exhaust work to it? Uh, it's all custom, no cats, straight pipe with QTP cut out mufflers in the rear. That looks good. And I needed something wider because of the flares, so they need. Did you put two pieces together? No, it's one piece. He's got parts for me. It, yeah, it's one piece. Um, the flares are from Ulterior Motor Shop in California. They made these stainless steel flares. They had universal flares. So this is but, just not like a plug and play, uh, like bolt on here. It's an all custom job. They had these flares. They make flares, and when I told them the specs of what I wanted, they had to make custom flares. From my specs. So these look a little bit, quite a bit larger actually yeah. than, than the regular. They're the biggest flares they ever made. And compared to the wide body that's coming out in 2020, it's probably three inches wider. This car's 10 inches. Wow. Wide. So yeah, this looks a lot better you know, than. Yeah. So a question um, I have is how did you get the uh, rims and tires to not look? It looks natural. It looks nice. So what did you have to do to the rims and tires in order for it to kind of be flush with with this flare so that was part of the delay we started with the wheels um the wheels are ag luxury i got them through modified concepts okay um we started with the wheels and then based on the specs of the wheels we tried to get flares to go along with it we got the first set of flares it didn't work out it was flush so i couldn't air out because i'm on air ride so i had to order a second set of flares and redo it even wider to go along with the wheels because it's cheaper to redo the flares. So what the were, what are the dimensions of, of these wheels? The wheels are 12 and a half in the rear, but you know, as you know, it's all offset. So offset yeah. can make a, you know, the diff distance. Yep. Did you have to go with spacers or any? I have any? spacers because after we put everything together, it wasn't as close to the uh, flare that I wanted it to be. So I put uh, How do you feel the ride though with the... It rides the same. Same? It rides the same. In Same the corners, it feels a little different. Yes. This is a wider track. It's different, right? Yeah. So it handles well. Um, the rear wing, the diffuser, not the diffuser. The um, wicker bill is, is 
TL1 add-ons with okay. the book. The wrap is Avery, frozen black chrome. And the wrap, the same guy you had a... Uh, self-made right? artworks, they, they do everything. Everything I don't do, they do self-made artworks. So, they're in the operators. You got five inch tips? He welded the tips, he welded my whole exhaust and self-made them. So this, so this diffuser, where, where, where did Where's you get that? Pro okay. Material from Metro Restyling, um, but Mike itself made the, the whole wrap. It's Avery, Avery Frozen Black. Hole. I gotta tell you, I'm so much better person than when you show on pictures. Like the, the gray changes as you walk around and changes the shape. Like, see now it changes again. It's gorgeous, I know, it's right? The way, like here, it, it looks one way here, another color there. Looks so we can't see now because it's daytime, but it's a whole light underglow from um, Lighter Trends. The other ones who I got everything from. It's done with a straw package that I do myself because I, like I have a problem with lights. Is the Hellcat emblem right here larger than, than a regular yeah, Hellcat? I, I think I got it on Amazon. I right yeah? I mean, it, it's, it, yeah, it really it looks good though. Yeah. It the car. <laughs> Agreed. I like the rims. I, I thought you yeah you had the, <coughs> the same wheels from before. It looked no, the same design. No, they they would have been the, the one you powder coated black, black. I remember. Yeah. 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 We get All right, guys. So you see it. This thing is sick. And uh, you know what? If you want to give them a follow, so in the description. So you this is the very first Hellcat that white body in the United States, the fattest one. Oh, this is the biggest. This right? definitely. It might be the. I saw picture of a wide body Hellcat in, in a car show and it was like not flares like the back was wide okay like complete custom job but I've never seen it again I only saw it in a picture on the internet well they're gonna see it now so. well guys in the description you're gonna see uh, Hellcat enforcers Instagram link definitely go check him out unbelievable uh, road to what we see here he's gone through probably three or four different iterations and uh it's looking mean this thing is looking real mean <laughs>